DDRSD RAM stands for Double Data Rate Synchronous Dynamic Random Access Memory, and it is a type of computer memory that transfers data twice per clock cycle. The first generation was introduced in the early 2000s as a faster improvement over SDRSD RAM, or Single Data Rate Synchronous Dynamic Random Access Memory. DDR1, launched in 2000 and was the first generation of DDR memory used in PCs around 2000 to 2004. It operated at 2.5 volts, and it could be spotted by a single notch in the center of the stick. DDR1 modules typically maxed out at 1 gigabyte each. It doubled the data transfer rate compared to older SDRAM by sending data on both the rising and falling edges of the clock signal. DDR1 modules typically came in 184 pins for desktops and 200 pins for laptops, and ran at speeds from 200 to 400 megahertz, with up to 3.2 gigabytes per second of bandwidth. It first showed up in computers with Intel Pentium 4 and AMD Athlon processors. Today, DDR1 is long outdated, replaced by faster generations like DDR4 and DDR5, but it paved the way for modern memory technology. DDR2 DDR2 was the second generation of DDR memory technology used in computers. It was introduced around 2003, succeeding DDR1, and offered faster data transfer speeds and improved performance for systems of that time. DDR2 operated at higher clock speeds compared to DDR1. Its data transfer rates typically ranged from 400 to 1066 megahertz, making it noticeably faster. It used 1.8 volts instead of the 2.5 volts used by DDR1, which means it consumed less power and produced less heat. DDR2 doubled the internal bus speed, allowing more data to be moved per clock cycle. This results in higher memory bandwidth, averaging 8.5 gigabits per second, improving multitasking and system responsiveness. DDR2 had 240 pins compared to DDR1's 184 pins in a different notch position, making it incompatible with DDR1 slots. It used a 4N prefetch buffer and maxed out at 4 gigabytes per module. Although DDR2 offered higher speeds, it had slightly higher latency than DDR1. However, the speed advantage generally outweighs this drawback. DDR2 was widely used with Intel Core 2, Duo, and early AMD Phenom and Athlon processors during the mid-2000s. DDR2 was a major step forward in memory technology, faster, cooler, and more efficient than its predecessor, DDR1. It played a crucial role in enhancing computer performance during the mid-2000s era. Eventually, it was replaced by DDR3, but DDR2 paved the way for faster and more efficient memory technology. DDR3 DDR3 was the third generation of double data rate memory that powered millions of computers worldwide. It was introduced in 2007. DDR3 runs on 1.5 volts, with low voltage versions like DDR3L at 1.35 volts and DDR3U at 1.25 volts, meaning better energy efficiency and less heat. It operates at speeds ranging from 800 to 2133 MHz, with data transfer rates up to 17 gigabits per second, giving faster system performance and smoother multitasking. Pin count for desktop modules remained at 240 pins, but the notch shifted again, making it incompatible with DDR2 slots. DDR3 also features an 8-bit prefetch buffer, doubling what DDR2 offered, allowing more data to be transferred. It was first seen with early Intel Core i series and AMD FX processors and maxed out at 16 gigabytes per module. It became the standard memory for PCs, laptops, and servers from around 2008 to 2016, balancing speed, efficiency, and affordability. Though DDR4 and DDR5 have now taken over, DDR3 remains a reliable, affordable, and efficient option for older systems. DDR4 It was introduced in 2014, replacing DDR3 as the new memory standard for desktops, laptops, and servers. DDR4 operates at 1.2 volts compared to DDR3's 1.5 volts, making it more power efficient and cooler, perfect for both laptops and high-performance PCs. 
It delivers speeds from 1600 up to 3200 megahaz and even beyond in overclocked modules. The data transfer rate can reach 25 gigabits per second or more, giving faster load times, smoother multitasking, and better overall system responsiveness. DDR4 modules came in 288 pins for desktops and 260 pins for laptops. They are not backward, compatible with DDR3 since the notch and voltage are completely different. DDR4 features a 16-bit prefetch buffer, doubling that of DDR3, allowing higher efficiency when transferring large amounts of data. It also supports larger module capacities, meaning systems can handle more RAM for demanding tasks like gaming, video editing, and 3D rendering. Some DDR4 modules include error-correcting code, often used in servers for data accuracy and reliability. It first launched with Intel Haswell E-Series and AMD Athlon X4 processors. DDR4 became the global standard from 2015 to 2021, offering faster speeds, higher bandwidth, and better power efficiency than any memory before it. DDR5 DDR5 is the fifth and latest generation of DDR computer memory, launched in 2020, replacing DDR4. It operates at 1.1 volts and the pin count remained at 288 pins, but the notch shifted again, making it incompatible with DDR4 slots. It delivers faster speeds starting at 4,800 megatransfers per second and bandwidth averaging 38 gigabits. DDR5 uses dual 32-bit channels for better multitasking with built-in power management ICs. DDR5 modules have massive capacities of up to 128 gigabytes per module and include on-die ECC for reliability. DDR5 memory was first adopted by Intel Alder Lake and AMD Ryzen 7000. DDR5 provides smoother performance for next-gen gaming, 8K content creation, and heavy AI workloads. Thank you all for watching. Hit subscribe and leave your thought about this video in the comments.